Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these Kroger brand uh, sausage, egg, and cheese croissants. Uh, looks pretty good. The sausage looks really good. Um, we bought these at for $2.49 at Kroger, of course. There are two sandwiches in the box. The uh, entire thing, two sandwiches, is 9.2 ounces or 260 grams. So like I said, that's for two of them. They're fully cooked. You keep them frozen. You don't thaw these. A lot of times with sandwiches, the breakfast sandwiches especially, you thaw them out. Uh, overnight for the best results. This one doesn't, ha this one's not like that. This one you just eat it uh, or you just go from frozen. So um, if you eat both sandwiches, it's 780 calories. If you only eat one sandwich, it's 390 calories. And here's the info for you. And let's see, there's a little whatever. So we're going to remove sandwich from the plastic wrap. Um, see, it says keep frozen to ready use. Uh, wrap loosely in a paper towel or a napkin, place on a microwave safe plate, paper plate. Microwave on high for one minute and 15 seconds to 145. I'll probably just do the 115. Uh, let's say in the microwave for one minute before serving, blah, blah, blah. The reason being is sandwiches tend to work better in my microwave with the lowest temperature or they tend to get hard. So it like overcooks them. Okay, here it is, frozen hard as a brick. So I'm going to take this out of a pretty thick sandwich. Um, I'm going to take it out of the plastic and make sure that everything's uh, lined on the on the croissant really good. Put it in a paper towel and I'll be back. All right, here it is out of the microwave. You can see all this on the bottom. It actually stuck to the paper towel really bad. So I had to like peel it off. But here's what it looks like. You can see the cheese is good and melty and the sausage is good and hot. Looks good. Um, the bread's pretty tender. Back here it's a little tight filling. I don't know if it's going to be... Um, chewy or not, but a croissant's a little chewy anyway. So I'm gonna um, well, let this cool off for a minute and then I'll be back. I'm gonna see if the cheese, oh yeah, there's the egg. So yeah, I'm gonna let this cool off for a minute, I'll be back. I gave it just a minute to cool off, not very long at all. So um, I'm just gonna take a bite, I'll take a bite right here, right right in that corner right there. And yes, I know it's a circle, so there's technically no corner, that part right there. I like the flavor of the croissant. It's kind of got a, a little bit of a buttery kind of feel to it. Uh, the sausage has a decent flavor to it. It's not uh, super spicy, but it has some savory spice to it. It's not like burn your throat spicy at all, but it does have some spice to it where it's got some, some flavor, so that's nice. Um, the texture of the croissant's really nice. It's flaky. It's got a little chew to it, which is fine. Everything's good and hot for the times I put it in there. Like I said, I just put it in there for 115, the lowest end. For my microwave, works perfect. Uh, for your microwave, you may need more time. I think this is good. It's not, it's not the perfect sandwich. It doesn't have like the best flavor ever. Um, the the croissant is a little tough and chewy in spots, but other places it's really good and and, um, and flaky and and soft. So it's a hit or miss on the croissant itself. The egg has a good flavor. The cheese is good and goopy. I can't really taste it, but it's good and, and melty. Um, the sausage has a decent flavor, a decent texture. So I'm going to give this a four out of five. I definitely think it's worth trying out. It's not quite to that level to where I would say good a five, but it is It is a good sandwich. Uh, definitely worth trying out. If you have a Kroger in your area and you want to try them out, definitely worth trying out. Um, yeah, I think a four out of five is pretty safe. If you had some hot sauce, you could sprinkle that on there too if you wanted to. So uh, yeah, hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.